sixth dimension. Hey guys, I'm Cover Dudes, all the way from down. Today is just a bit of a slight breakdown. There isn't much to talk about of the new trailer Nexon release of the new map called Slaughterhouse. Now, we thought this map was going to be called Rod and Me, as said in the leaked content, but it's actually going to be called Slaughterhouse. And as you can see here, is the video and the trailer, it's gameplay. It looks very, very, very true to what we've seen. Exactly that picture right there. So it's very, very, very true to what we've seen in the leaked content, just a different name. Now this map is not going to be like a normal map in combat arms, it's actually going to be a clan war only map for search and destroy. Now hopefully it's going to be like, like PRs and later on what's going to happen is that later on once a couple of months or whatever it's going to be so you can play them in normal modes, that would be nice. But you know from what they've said it's going to be a clan war only map at the moment. Now since oh, I don't really just want to talk about what you can see on the screen I just wanted to point, it out, point out some stuff you guys might have missed during the video. Right here's the first one. Look at those hands. Have you seen those hands as a character before? I sure haven't. I think that may be a new mercenary. As you can see right here, the hand with the gun points out there's a spider. Spider vs Scorpions. Maybe we can see a repeat from last year. That was a really, really great event that Nixon pulled off. Hopefully they can do it again. Heaps more people started playing the game. Get some really awesome rewards and real. I hopefully Nixon will do that again because I honestly, that made me play Combat Arms a, a whole lot more because of that event. Now, I just want to talk very briefly about the clan ladder system as well. Now, from what we've seen that pretty much Combat Arms is just a system where the people at the very, very top, uh, you know the top, it's all ranked on EXP pretty much, not via wins. Now, I think this clan ladder system is going to be, kind of brings some more in-depth to the clan system that we've seen at the moment. Maybe you win, you get some prizes or something like that. You can verse other clans, schedule the matches as we've seen on the site, there's a little function that said, you know, coming soon, and that's been coming soon for like the past couple of years, maybe that will be put into effect, and like you can schedule matches at a certain time, and all the, it automatically joins all the people that have been scheduled on the joint at that certain time, I don't know, I'm just speculating, I'm pulling out random ideas, but clan ladder system, that's going to be in the game as well, hopefully that will be taken into effect, and hopefully they'll make the game much more enjoyable if you play in a clan, and maybe you can win some prize or something like that, but on top of that you know we've got the slaughterhouse we've got the new map looks really nice it kind of something along what I really like you know very tactical map you know lots of different ways to approach the you know approach your objectives and stuff it feels a very warhead like to me I don't know why maybe because you drop down like it is in Warhead in the in the slaughterhouse room but for, for me it just feels like there's lots of high points you know there's lots of stuff you can do in this map and that's why I really like lots of tactics so hopefully whenever Nexon releases this map hopefully it'll be pretty nice map to play I'll play it with ZoomX have a look around but other than that Undercover Dudes all right from down another out